everyone, it's Maisie from school. When we're back at school, we're going to be learning about the theme, can we explore it? And looking at maps and going on adventures and all fun stuff like that. So I thought I'd print out a map of the world. And we can have a look together at the different countries and continents and see what we can find. So we'll start at this side. And here, this green section is called North America. Hmm, what can we see in North America? I can see an igloo and an Eskimo. So that tells me it's cold in this area. I can see a moose. I can see a cowboy hat. Ooh, does anyone know what this is? That's the Statue of Liberty. You might have seen that on TV or in other places as it's quite famous. So that's North America. Ooh, what's this up here? That's right, it's a polar bear. This is called Greenland. Let's move on to this one. Can you see what it is? It's South America. Now the first thing I can see in South America is this parrot in Brazil. I can see some coffee beans. So that must be where they grow the coffee. I can see an animal, I think it's a cow in Argentina. I can see some bananas. So that makes me wonder if they grow bananas in this part of the world. What shall we go to next? Let's go to Africa in the yellow section. Now there's lots of countries in Africa. I can see Egypt and in Egypt we have the pyramids. You might have seen those on TV as well, they're quite famous. Does anyone know what this animal is here? It's got a hump on its back. It's a camel. I can see a traditional drum. I can see a tall giraffe. You might have heard of the safari in Africa where you can see the different animals. There might also be lions and zebras. Look, there's a car that you go on when you go to the safari. Anything else you can see? Right, let's move on to the orange section, which is Europe. We live in Europe in this country here. This is the United Kingdom, but we live in England. What can we see? We can see a castle. We can see someone skiing. That means it must be cold in this area. We can see, oh, what's this? That's the Eiffel Tower in Paris, which is in France. A lot of people go and see that. I can see a bull. I can see a football. That's Europe. Can anyone see what this little island is here? It's called Iceland and it's got a volcano on it. Now next we'll move on to the biggest continent that's on the map and that's called Asia, that's right. This big country here is called Russia 
and I can see lots of different things already in Russia. First of all, I can see a big grizzly bear. I can see some mountains. I can see some trees that look like Christmas trees. And I can see some babushka dolls. If we move down, we come to China, which is where pandas live. Some more mountains there. We've got India here, and this is the palace that's called the Taj Mahal. And what's this animal here? It's quite hard to see. It's an elephant. We've also got, looks like a prayer mat here. Anything else you can see? Oh, what's this country here? It's Japan. And look how big Asia is. It's got little islands down here. So we've got Singapore, Indonesia, the Philippines, Malaysia. Where shall we go next? Let's go to this purple one, which is called Australia. Now I can see a boomerang. I can see a fish that looks like Finding Nemo because in Australia, they've got lots of lovely sea creatures that live in the barrier reef. There's a kangaroo here. That's Australia. And if we go right to the bottom of the world, we've got Antarctica. What can you see in Antarctica? A penguin. That's where he lives. Does anyone know what this is called down here? It's called a compass and each point is pointing to a different direction. So we've got north, east, south, and west. And when we're going on big adventures, it helps us know which direction to travel in so we don't get lost. Well, we've looked at the world map now. If you want to have a look at a map yourself, I got this off the internet, so if you ask your parents or your guardians they might be able to print one off that you can look through by yourself thanks everyone see you at school